It is the start of our final day in Shapir. We may never again see this luxurious room and all of the souvenirs that we've acquired during our time within this lovely city. But one thing's for sure, we've got to make sure that they take care of my pristine mint complete copy of Quest for Glory 2. Imagine what would happen if it got damaged, or lost, or lost and damaged. My investment would be ruined, I mean, my treasured keepsake would be gone and I would be so sad. I'm sure that won't happen, right? Maybe I should take it with me just to be sure. No, I'm going adventuring, I can't do that. I'm just going to have to trust that it's in safe hands. And I'm sure it is. I'm sure it is. Hey uh, folks, it's Kikoski here, and welcome back to Let's Play Quest for Glory 2 VGA. And when last we left off, it is day 16. On day 17, we're off to Razir. And Razir sounds like such a wonderful place, it sounds awful. Hello! Hero, the Enchantress Aziza requests that you visit her home this day. Don't worry, I will. There are loads of people I'm going to have to see. Absolutely loads. I've got to say my farewells, after all. To you two, if no one else. Here is your morning meal of warm bread and honey butter, fresh fruit and tea, just as you prefer. Well, thank you very much. You are, of course, most welcome, my hero. And I will say farewell. Farewell, hero of Spielberg. I'm sure we'll meet on the evening, but still... Going will be a sad event. Will be sad. Your breakfast is delicious. That it is. Now let's head out and say hi to people. The poet Omar will thrill all who hear with his words of song after the setting of the sun in our own inn. I'll be there. It is said that you are going to journey to Razir. The Kata all hope for your safety and wish for your success, friend of the Kata. That's kind of you to say. Shall I speak to you and see if you have anything else to say? Uh, you don't seem to have anything else to say. But I will greet you. Greetings, Hero of Spielberg. Greetings indeed. May your day be filled with the scent of sweet flowers, Effendi. Okay, first things first, we should go and do the very, very important thing, which is go and see Aziza. Aziza asked for us specifically. Let's be prompt. Welcome, Derek. Thanks, Aziza. Who points? You have saved the city through your resourcefulness and bravery. You are very much a hero. Welcome to my home, Derek. May your deeds be remembered forever. I worked some magic last night to uncover information about your trip to Razir. I need to discuss this with you. Ooh, I like getting info. Come in, sit down, and we shall speak. Rog? Not you, Rogair! Welcome, stranger. I shall be honored to have you for a guest as well. Uh oh? Grog de Grog? Perhaps he has a Sora's throat us? Oh, oh, I get it, game! Come in. We shall all sit and see what we shall see. You are obviously enchanted. So we need now to see what is your true form. Ah, that explains a lot of things. That explains why you're so eager to hang around us. Why you appear smarter than the average Saurus. Water of wisdom, liquid of life. I call upon thee three times three. Mirror without what lies within. So we shall have the true to see. Look into the water and we shall see your true form. Ah, the Emir Aras al-Din. There was good reason why my spell could not locate you in Mazir. Oh! Adavis turned you into a Saurus. You are under the most powerful enchantment. The caster must be a very skilled wizard to craft such a spell. Adavis. Water of wisdom, liquid of life, knowledge now is what I seek. Reveal the caster of the spell. Upon the one which I beseek. Yep. You must take the caravan to Razir. 
I will keep the Emir with me for safekeeping while you find the means to restore him to his rightful shape. We all are hoping for your success, hero, and eagerly await the pleasure of your return. Farewell, Derek. What, no tea? I suppose this is a desperate time. Let's go and say hi to you. The caravan to Brazil will leave with the dawn of tomorrow's sun, hero. So we have today, and that is all. Well, let's go say hi to everyone. And bye to everyone. Like you. There are no thanks great enough for all you have done and will do. That's very kind of you. Let's say hi to you. Rumor has it that you are journeying to his ear. It is. It has been said that you seek to restore the old Emir. Yeah, that's true. You could not forget your friends the Kata. The homeland of our people should be restored through your actions. I hope so. I hope so. Also, how are my water skins? They are completely full. Excellent. Let's head... Ooh, we should... We'll go to you. We'll probably be coming back to you in a bit. As I might try and get a bit more money. I want to get as much money as I can. Ah, I didn't notice you come in. I have heard a rumor that you are taking a caravan to Vizier. It will be best if you purchase some extra pills to take with you. That is very true. For there is no apothecary in Razir. That said, I think 152 health restoring pills, 42 poison curing pills, and 19 stamina curing pills should be sufficient. The six golden dinars, however, we could probably do a bit better than that. Maybe we should go to uh, the money changer and change those sem teams. It's certainly way less. Let's pop over here and say hi to all of you, including Keep On. I'm sorry, but I have to go. May good fortune watch over you always. I hope it will. And I will speak with you as well, my friend. There is no doubt that you are the hero all the Kata have waited for. You are truly wonderful to travel to Razir to restore our home. I'll do the best I can. It has been spoken on the streets that you journey to Razir. Surely your homeland will be returned. I hope I can achieve it. I really hope I can. With maximum intelligence, I have the best chance possible of doing so. Hello, buddy. Top of the morning to ya, Mahaba. Let's do, pussycat. <laughs> I'm gonna say hi. You have no news for me. Okay, I guess I'm just gonna say farewell. Ciao for now, pal. Come back again, friend. <laughs> you could buy my rope, but you've climbed the ladder of success without it. So I'll keep it. Speaking of finals, Lionel, so you're graduating to Brazil. In a barrow speaking. Beware, Larry. I hear it's hairy there, so watch your derriere. Happy trails to you until we meet again. Buy those banditos! Good luck, Buck! <laughs> Had to leave it off with one more joke, didn't you? Okay, next place we can go to. Let's actually go to you! Ah, not open yet. Never mind! Let's go instead to the weapon shop. So you're gonna restore Razir to its former glory? Don't give him an inch. Show him who's boss! Well, that's... Surprisingly encouraging words coming from you. I'll try my best. Now let me speak to you. All Kata rejoice that you now go to Brazil, for we know you will restore our homeland. I mean, I could fail. I, I haven't always been that great at succeeding. So you don't have any specific dialogue for me. Fair enough. And there's no one here, I imagine? No, no one here at all. That's fair enough. Okay, next place we can go to, we can go to... We've been to Aziza. We can go to the Astrologer. I have heard that you shall travel to Aziza. Good luck, and may the stars watch over and guide you. 
Thank you ever so much. Now we head to the... Oh, careful, careful. We head over to the final plaza, which is here, and say hi to you, you two. Hello! Do you have anything to say? No, you do not. What about you? Anything to say? No, you also have nothing to say. So the only people we haven't been to yet are the Adventurers Guild and the Money Changer. We are going to be going to the Adventurers Guild because I have a hunch that there's something we're going to be able to do. Also, we have to override a save. Because, of course, we do. Let us get rid of... Ah, let's get rid of that one. And then we can make a save called 48. Let's pop in. And say farewell to Ahura. Ooh, Rikisha's here. So, hero, not being content with having merely saved the city, I see what you're about to attempt to save the land of Shapir as well. Seems so. You have proven yourself both brave and resourceful by your actions. The journey you are about to make is to a very dark and dangerous place. The foe you will face is very powerful in the ways of magic. Luckily, I'm powerful in the ways of stab. Be wary and alert, for you will be surrounded by enemies. Yet trust your instincts, my friend, for you may still make allies by your actions. All of us in this city will be hoping for your safety, for all know of the seriousness of your mission. May fortune smile upon you, Derek. Thanks, my friend. Keep your weapon handy, hero, and don't let your enemies get you. You and I may be practice some more when you get back. If you will permit it, my friend, perhaps you and I could practice with weapons before you go. I happen to know some skills with weapons that may help you on your mission. I will absolutely take that offer! Let us go and train Rakesh! And you're going to come in? And then Rakesh is going to come in! Or maybe just you will and I'll have to speak to Rakesh and talk about the challenge. Oh, no, here comes Rakesh. Right, let's speak to you. About. There's a lot of stuff you could talk about, but let's talk about challenge. I accept your challenge gladly, my friend. All right, I'm going to have to be on my game here. Because you're tough. Oh, yes. Here we go. Oh. Oh, 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 you're good. You're good. Oh, oh you are good. But, oh, 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 you're very good. Go. Oh. Careful. Get a stab him. One, two, oh, oh, you did dodge. Now let's, oh, he's down, but not out. Critical hit. Oh, you're fast at that. So as soon as you block, I need to be ready. Because you do that. I could actually get a counterattack in if I was fast enough. Let's see if I can do that next time. So. Do that. Do that. How about the Rakesh? Oh. Oh, did you use magic there? I think you did. I think you used magic. But I have a power all my own. Aha! Counterattack, Rakesh! Can I get... Ooh, careful. Oh, Oh! Aha! I was trying to get the uh, duck one. But I'm not sure I'll be able to get that. You are pretty tough! Very tough, but... Ooh, ooh. ooh didn't avoid that, did I? No, I did not. Now, it's showing hit points, but in reality, it's probably... Oh, it's probably stamina. Oh, aha! Counter-attack! You force Rakesh to yield the combat. Victory is ours! You are good. Very good. Soon, you will be a master with your sword. However, the real battle is not always won by a swing or a thrust. To fight with honor is not always easy. 
Sometimes the way of honour will seem foolish to those that have none. Nevertheless, without honour, there is no victory. With honour, there is no real defeat. Hint, hint, these are the ways you will become a paladin. That's the game giving you a not so double swings can wear down an enemy's defense, but still leave your opponent standing, and thus in a position to mount an offense. Next time you fight, try following up an inverse swing with an overhead slash. This will knock most opponents off their feet when it connects. Execute the overhead slash by pressing keypad 7 immediately after an inverse swing. Yep, 797. An opponent whose attack you just ducked will be off balance for a split second. By reacting quickly, you can catch them off guard with a quick retaliatory attack. Next time you fight, try swinging your weapon in an upward arc after ducking a high attack. Your opponent will need quick reflexes to avoid it. The rising slash is performed by ducking an opponent's high attack and, tap and tapping keypad 7 before getting up. When you catch your opponent's blade with your own weapon, you will be in an opportune position to quickly retaliate, as long as you keep your wits about you. Next time you fight, try launching a quick swing after the enemy's attack bounces off your blade. Execute the counter-attack by pressing keypad 7, home, immediately after parrying an opponent's attack. Jumping over a low attack is a good way to avoid damage, but a quick secondary attack by the enemy may still catch you off guard when you land. Next time you fight, try executing an overhead slash while coming down from a jump- uh, What? Execute the skull splitter by pressing E, the moment your enemy launches a low attack. What? That is something I did not know. I don't know if I'll ever have the chance to use it, but still, that's an amazing thing. That is amazing. Okay, how is our... Okay, the only thing that got drained was our stamina. That's fine. That is fine. Below you. Don't bother, he only tries to show off. What things can I talk to you about? I can talk to you about a lot of things. In order to become a warrior in Ahura's tribe, one must be speedy, accurate, and agile. This is easily recognized in her fighting style. Talk about the fighting style. Ahura mostly depends on her agility and mobility to get the better of her opponents. Properly evading or blocking Ahura's attack should be the first thing on your mind at all times. Attack when you see an opening, but be prepared for counterattacks. Good to know. There are several techniques that can aid you in battle. Proper use of each of them is often the key to victory. When mounting an offense, an inverse swing can be used to follow up a swing for additional damage. Furthermore, an overhead slash can be used to knock an opponent to the ground and avoid a quick counterattack. Use the rising slash upon to turn the tables on an opponent who relies on high attacks. Use the counter slash to retaliate against blockable attacks by your adversary. When you are forced to jump back to avoid damage, your instincts may trigger the leaping lunge. Utilize the skull splitter on opponents who use low attacks to quickly end the battle in your favor. That's a lot of cool information there. A dagger is incapable of doing large amounts of damage, but it can still be deadly in the hands of an experienced wielder. They can double as projectiles. I personally do not prefer their use. That is understandable. The sword is the finest of weapons. It requires both skill and strength in order to wield correctly. Other weapons are available. Your physical strength determines the damage dealt by your blows, but power only makes a difference if you're at least as good a swordsman as your opponent. True? Skill is what really matters in combat. A talented swordsman can adapt his style the second the situation requires it. If someone only depends on his physical prowess in combat, he may be better off wielding a club. Clubs have their merits, though. It would be best to wait until you're back in the main guild hall before telling about your stories, hero. That is true. That is true. Let us head back into the main hall. And thank you for the honor of dueling you. We shall thank. I am honored to aid you, and I am honored to be aided by you. Farewell, young adventurer. We shall speak again soon, no doubt. That we shall! And I will say thank you, Ahura, for all of the help you've given me. Ah, hang on. I have to use thank this way. Even now, I forget. I try to be of help. 
you succeed. I beseech you later. And with that, we head out. And I think we've done everything that we can. This does mean that if we go out to get some money, we will not have access to Roguerre, which is unfortunate. It is been morning now, though, so the last thing we can do is go talk to Dinazad. The word on the street is that you seek to quash the oppression of Razir and bring freedom there. Let us hope that you are as skilled as I have heard, for you will certainly not get by on looks alone. That's kind of a vote of confidence, maybe? I would like to exchange money. Uh, I'd like to exchange a thousand seventeens into... Then again, I should be doing it in fifties. Oh, I can only do it in a hundreds. Well, well, we'll just do a thousand. There we are. Here you are. I just love intimate exchanges like this. So we now have 16 golden dinars and zero brass seventeens. So that was a straight exchange rate, which is nice. And when we come back, folks, we have 16 dinars to our name. And one day, the caravan to Razir will leave with the, with the dawn of tomorrow's sun, hero. Remember that. I will. I suppose I don't need this Riding Saurus title anymore? Maybe I could transfer it to a different Saurus in Brasilia, presuming they offer that service at all. But hey, we have one more day, and I feel like we should use it wisely and get some more money. We might need money when we go to Brasilia, though I get the feeling the game's going to give us some money via Omar. And... When we come back, we'll do just that. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're not. And if you are subscribed, press that bell for those notifications. And I'll catch you next time, folks. And I'll see you then. Later.